righty. So thanks to Inside Great Adventure, Inside GADV on Instagram. Go give him a follow. We have a construction update for Jersey Devil. And let me tell you, we have more exciting construction updates for Jersey Devil coming up. Um, can't announce anything yet, but there's definitely going to be some exciting stuff with the park and Inside Great Adventure for Jersey Devil. And um, some pretty cool opportunities coming up for Inside Great Adventure as well in terms of photo ops for the park as well. So super excited to announce those soon, but you're going to have to go follow him on Instagram to see those announcements. Um, but yes, the construction update. So first off, I want to hear from you guys down below in the comment section. When do you think this ride is going to open? Because I'm hearing such mixed um, results and uh, opinions from people of when they think Jersey Devil is going to open. Um, mainly, I'm trying to plan my trip down there, and uh, we're just trying to even get a month. So when do you guys think Jersey Devil is going to open at Great Adventure? Um, an estimate even. Um, I'm definitely thinking that this thing's going to actually be pretty on time. I'm looking at an early summer opening, but that's just me. Um, but nonetheless, not too much has changed from the last construction update. So footings are still being poured and uh, curing and lots of rebar cages and digging going on. The land looks really uh just ready for construction, period. Um, but again, no signs of track anywhere. So we are not hearing any news or seeing any signs of track being manufactured or being shipped or being stored on site. But again, some companies are pretty crafty in terms of hiding this. You know, you could be doing night deliveries. This is a pretty excluded park. It's not like a park like Canada's Wonderland where a giant track piece being shipped into Canada's Wonderland is going to be seen by everyone and their neighbor. Um, but nonetheless, it could be on site being stored somewhere where we can't see, or it could be on its way, it could be doing night shipments, who knows, but uh, I'm definitely expecting probably vertical construction if the track is being manufactured and ready, so again, a big if there. I'm expecting vertical to be sometime, you know, oh man, this is difficult, mid-January, end of January, we'll say, for vertical for this park, which is actually, if you think about it, these coasters, these Raptors are probably extremely easy to build. So that being like, you know, let's say it is a, a late January or even an early February. I'm guessing that this coaster could probably go up um, in a month or two at max. So and then you just add the the theming and that, like, I mean, like I, this coaster could be open have one of the earlier openings of a Six Legs coaster. Um, I have no idea. I, that's, again, why I wanted to ask you guys down at the beginning of the video what you guys think. But I don't know. This coaster is looking pretty promising, in my opinion. Like, Six Legs looks really on top of it for this coaster. Again, the marketing team over at Six Legs Great Adventure is killing it with these, like, very frequent construction updates. So definitely go check them out on any social media, um, Six Legs Great Adventure, because they've been truly immersive in terms of including the enthusiast community with their construction updates. So it's really exciting to see what comes out of Six Flags Great Adventure with this Jersey Devil coaster. You know that it's my one of my most anticipated coasters of 2020. It definitely be it'll probably be our first trip, um, international trip to go check out a new coaster. Anyways, hope you enjoyed this quick construction update. Don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't and share this video for others to enjoy. Have a good one guys. Bye.